Okay, welcome to Vlogmas video number eight. Okay, y'all guys know this is my first vlog. This is my first vlog channel. So, yes, I'm a little bit off with the vlogs, but I'm gonna still call them Vlogmas. I'm gonna try to catch up. Uh, cause I know I'm supposed to be on Vlogmas number 10, but this is Vlogmas number eight. Now, don't be surprised if you get two videos in one day. But this is what my little mini haul. I did Instacart. You know, and you guys know I got a soulful tea channel where I cook food. So I was trying to decide what I was going to cook for Sunday's dinner. And I just thought about this. I haven't made um, smothered meatloaf with some gravy and some mashed potatoes and some corn on the cob and stuff like that. So I decided to go ahead and do Instacart and integrate it with this vlogmas. Because guess what? I'm doing something that Prissy P did. Now, I don't know if I'm going to name it the same thing she named it. It was, because I thought it was interesting. I like Prissy P. I like um, um, Rayshawn, and I look at their um, channels. I think they got a PR game channel, Prissy P channel. Mama Bree and Prissy P got channels together. Shout out to all their channels and all their hard work they put in here on YouTube. So they did this thing, a giant um, Mac griddle. Now, I ain't buying nothing special. I'm going to use what I already got in my house. It may not be as big as this, but it's going to be bigger than the Mac Griddle that they got at McDonald's. So I was like, you know what? I need some content. Prissy P did that. It looked interesting. And I like it. And it is what Vlogmas. So guess what? We got to try out things. If I can get you guys some good, interesting videos. Okay? So let's take a look at the mini haul that I got. And then let's go in my kitchen. Let's do this giant mac griddle who don't like a good mac griddle right all right soul scar let's go all right guys well here we go i'm in the gross instacart grocery haul my granddaughter's coming up for a weekend and certain things that she like and i gotta have certain chips and stuff you know have stuff ready for her because this little girl all right, so she wanted some fruit loose, so let's just go right here. I got um, some Mama Celeste pieces. They was like one nineteen a piece. This Elio's cheese pizza, nine slices was like $9, some change, yes. And I think we got some Capri Sauce. Jax, did we get some Capri Sauce? I got one of Capri Sauce sitting outside. I didn't show you guys that. Um, I got some butter, but I can make that butter, um, what, that eggnog? But I can make that eggnog pound cake to you guys. I ain't had no butter. One of my granddaughters ate the tasty cakes. Look at them. They already been in it, right? They ate those up already. Couldn't even make it to the hall. I got three boxes of waffles. Straw, um, I wanted cinnamon because my family, who out there like them cinnamon waffles? My family like the cinnamon waffles, but we had to get substitute because they didn't have them. So I got one thing of strawberry waffles, two things of buttermilk waffles. We got some Jiffy cornbread mix to make some corn muffins. I got some syrup, three things of Simply Fruit Punch. Um, got some Kraft mayonnaise right here because I was low. Uh, we got some um, sweet relish back there. I have some... Crushed pineapple for an upcoming pineapple video that I never got to make on Thanksgiving. I added some more sweet peas because my kids love um, um, corn and peas mix. I was gone. All the peas was gone. Had some corn beach hash. Um, I like Libby's, but any brand would do. Um, two dozen of eggs, some chicken broth. Again, like I said, two things of Fruit Loops, family size. Um, my granddaughter loves salt and vinegar. She like the kettle cook. Um, so they salt and vinegar chips, some barbecue chips. I thought this was a hot. Let's say honey. <laughs> um, I got this three pounds of ground beef long. Um, great meatloaf coming on Sunday. Sunday dinner vlog. Um, let me see. Move these eggs away. Has some corn on the cob. I make with the meatloaf, and we got a roll of sausages. Um, I already, I thought I had them, but I just bought them. Gonna make that Prissy P video. Um, that giant. Um, <laughs> mine's may not be as big as hers, but it's gonna be um uh, a big mac griddle, sausage eggs mac griddle. Got some um more sausages. Um, my granddaughter love these right here. These um maple sauces, so I got those. Got some heavy cream that I need for a video. But like I said, and water's already got water already outside. This is just a little teeny hole to add on to the food that we already got here, guys. To add on to what I already got, you know, things I was missing. I think I even bought some bread. I think I got bread and hamburger rolls yesterday. 
and I didn't show you guys that. And you know, I try to have all my granddaughter's favorite when she comes stay on her days that she here for she like, you know, what is she like to eat? Stuff be here. I oh and I think I got oh I ain't show this right here. Guys, even though I make homemade macaroni and cheese, I always get me a couple of boxes of this. I got two boxes of crab deluxe um macaroni. And I think this is it. This is all I um got. And I think this little bit of stuff. Y'all, a hundred. A hundred. But this giants, if you're in the DMV area, you know what the giants is. This instant cart giant haul came to a hundred and twelve dollars, y'all. A hundred and twelve dollars of this stuff. I don't know, food's getting expensive. Can you this a hundred and twelve dollars for food? I'm like get the fudge out of here so yeah so okay now let's go make what that giant i'm gonna be a medium i'm gonna be a large <laughs> i'll be a large sausage eggs mcgriddle that's what i'm called mine Oh, y'all, my video cut off. I don't know why it cut off. I was talking, being happy, and everything. <laughs> the video cut off on me. All right. This is the big Sasha's patty. I want to put it in the pan. Let's go. Y'all ready? This is the pan. You know this thing going to shrink, right, y'all? I broke my head. What the heck? Okay, let me get a um a spatula. Yeah, it's stuck to this paper. Okay. It's so perfectly round though. Oh. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. ah, there it is. There it is. Now y'all know this is gonna shrink. So we have a side and I want it flat so it can cook. So whatever size this sausage ends up being, that's the type of size, that's the type of I'm side. Ooh, saucy. Smell the sausage smell good. Whatever size the sausage end up being, that's how big I'm attempt to make the two pancakes. We just eat breakfast. That's crazy. And I'm not making home. I got some regular old complete pancake mix that we're gonna be using. I got my bowl, got my wild whisk. I'm gonna turn my sausage down. I don't wanna be black. Why right, y'all? It smells good. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Oh, what's that? I dropped them. I dropped them full, y'all. I got some hungry jack pancake mix. I got some um Aunt Mama Pearl Miller Company. It's not called Aunt Mama no more. Oh, that's right. Okay, so I just gotta get my milk and the sausage is cooking. Alright, y'all. Let's see. Let me flip this sausage. journey. I'm calling you out, girl. Make this on your channel. A giant sausage and egg and cheese McGriddle. Falling Prissy P. Thank you, Prissy and Rayshawn. <laughs> okay, guys.
We about to make this pancake mix now. I use milk in my pancake mix, not water. So while the sausage can see, look, I don't have no paper towels. So I got to add paper towels. I need paper towels, toilet paper, and trash bags add to my list. So what I'm about to do now is that I'm about to, I'm going to put my sausages in the um, strainer. So all that grease could drain off. But in the meantime, right here, guys, I am going to be making the pancake mix. And again, I use milk. And I don't want a thin pancake because I want to have some, um, and this is a complete pancake mix. So, yeah. And I hope it's enough. Well, I'm making a mess. Hope it's enough for two. Yeah, I know it gotta be thick, but I don't want to make it too thin, Jackson. You like it thick? You like it thick? <laughs> no, seriously. Um, that gonna be this thick. I'm getting so happy. You get so happy because I'm making this. It smells, it smells good, don't it? <laughs> New Life Journey, follow, look at Prissy Peas. Oh, give me some butter. I just want some butter, it's on the, um, on the, on the, on the stand over there. Mm -hmm. Give me a stick of butter. And this is not on my food channel, cause this is a vlog. This is a can you do it type video. So, this is how thick I want it. Just like that. That's good enough. Let me put my sausage, because it's done. Let me put it in the a strainer. All right, y'all. My pan been cleaned and washed. My sausage is in the strainer. Two stick. I mean, two tablespoons of butter. I got my pan on the medium low. And I got some butter syrup. It ain't got to be name brand. She ain't say how much butter syrup. So I'm going to like um, a tablespoon. She ain't say. So we, ooh, it smell good. We're going to let that melt together. They got too much butter syrup. Let me say some syrup. Got my little glass jar. Let me put a little bit of this butter. Because I want my pancake. I use that for the top one. That's a little bit too much. Okay. Okay. She really didn't say how much, but I did see it was a lot. But I don't know if I want to do a whole lot. Oh, this is enough for two. And so what I'm going to do. Okay, they got a pancake mix. I want to take my spoon. Mmm, smells good. So I want it to be as big as the sauces. So I'm going to take my spoon, spread it out, but also leave enough room for my spatula to do some flipping. You know pancakes, so you supposed to let it bubble. So, it's on a medium high, and we're going to let it bubble. I'm nervous. <laughs> Y'all nervous about this part. I'm just going to let it get all bubbly. Okay. You, oh, baby, you feel your leg. <laughs> all right, y'all. We're looking at Prissy P video. So, to flip it, it's too big. So, I don't have no parchment paper. So, okay. I put it on there, right? Then you're going to take the frying pan. I'm going to burn myself. Wait a minute. You're going to put it back on the frying pan like this. Because the caramel. Oh, the caramelization. Woo! 
Give me that arm. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> okay. Zach, stop screaming. Again, I burnt this joint. I let it cook too long. Cause I didn't know what I was doing. Okay. Back to the joint board. Let's start over. Round two. I got more syrup, don't worry. And I just made a more pancake mix. I got more pancake mix. Okay. Man. As soon as I see the bubbles. Take my spoon. And spread out my pancake mix. I want this big. It's a sausage. Okay. You're gonna get this about five minutes. As soon as I see the bubbles, then I'm gonna flip. I need it. that black stain. All right, y'all. We about to do it. Cause I ain't got but no more pancake. I only had a little bit of pancake mix left, right? So it's not sticking. So oh, but you know what? I still burned it. What the fudge? I think it's the syrup, but it's not really burnt burnt. Who gonna eat this? <laughs> That's what I burned it again. But it's not that burning. Is it? Okay, it's not that burning. It's not that burnt, y'all. <laughs> I'm still gonna make it. Here we go, y'all. This is my last pancake. If this mess up, I'm on epic fail. One, <laughs> two. Okay, I did it. Okay, so we gotta get these dishes ready. We wash this stuff out so we can make what the omelet, the egg to go on here. It smells so good, but she did it. Okay, guys, I washed up my other dishes, but that caramelization makes that pan hard. So I even with the nonstick, I had to um, you know. So I got five large eggs. But I'm not going to use all, all of them at once. I'm going to use this right here. They're going to make, I guess, like an omelet. You know. Um, put what you like on your eggs. What you like on your eggs? What you like on your eggs? I'm about to mess everything up. Trying to find pepper. <laughs> all right, y'all. So, like I said, thank you, Prissy P. I know this wasn't a challenge. But I'm challenging a new life journey. DC Kool-Aid and Lisa... And also Trey and Mimi. Yeah, let's make this giant. This giant um Mac griddle. You can make it as big as this, as big as mine's, but it must be bigger than a McDonald's Mac griddle. Alright. Fold that in half. Now make two of these to go up on there. It's like an omelet. Let that cook. One half to go. I'm going to pull this all the way over to the edge. Five eggs, y'all. Up. So we about to go look at Christmas lights. We got an appointment at 5 30. We leave out at 5 30. So if you're in the DMV area, you know Weckman's Park, where they do the Christmas lights at. 
Online tickets, eight dollars in person ten. All right, y'all, this is the last of it. Last and final armor. So, I have made a giant mech griddle. She didn't say it was a challenge, but it was interesting to make. Look, it don't have to be as big as hers or as big as mine, but it got to be bigger than McDonald's. Look at this. Look at this. I look dark. I got to get me some white in my kitchen. I got to buy me some more white, y'all. Look at this. Like, share, subscribe. Oh, y'all want to know what it tastes like? Hit that bell to be notified and check it in the next video. In the video, it's going to be a short. Check it out in my short. Yes. Go check out New Life Journey. Go check out Soul T on her cooking channel. Stay here and check out Soul T Vlogs. And sisterhood, me and my sister. We gotta get some videos up. They're coming soon. All right, guys. And to what? The next vlog. See you in the next vlog. See you in the next vlog. See you in my next vlog. See you in my next vlog. I'm out.